Get right with you. I'ma get right with you. Bad bitches, fuck up, then dismiss them. Bad. Woo. I ain't really here to take no pictures. Flash. Middle finger up for the system. Fuck them. Yeah. Who is robotic? I ain't. This is your girl Vel, and welcome back to my YouTube channel where we're always lit. Where we at, y'all? I'm sorry. I'm tired. I've been at work all day. But I wanted to keep being consistent on YouTube and, you know, uploading videos and stuff like that. Like, I have, you know, recorded videos and stuff like that it's just that I haven't edited the video so I do have more videos coming soon I promise but I'm definitely tonight going to do story time because when I do story time it's not that much editing I just really just upload the video and stuff like that because I don't have to really edit anything or anything like that but um yeah they will be coming soon it's just a whole bunch of editing and stuff like that it's a whole bunch of work and I'm supposed to start my new job soon so it's like I want to go ahead and edit these videos and start putting them out so that you guys have something to watch or whatever like that but anyways you guys don't forget to hit that like button that subscribe button and that bell button so you get these notifications when I upload a new video um tonight we're going to dang my head look a mess y'all <laughs> But, um, story night. So, what story do I want to tell y'all guys tonight? I have so many of them. Uh, I don't know. Okay, you know what? I'm going to tell y'all a silly story. So, back in the day, I think I was, I don't know, I was in middle school though. I know that. Because I was staying at a university apartment. All my Norfolk people, y'all know about the university apartments over there by Lake Telemetal. But, um, yeah, uh, so, we had this little car. I don't know if you guys remember those little, <laughs> those little cars that you had to, like, run and push and then jump in the car. So, you know, the car that, so the car will start. Well, <laughs> my mom had one of these cars like that, and... It was a little gray car, a little two-door. And, you know, every time we had to go somewhere, it was just so embarrassing because <laughs> we had to run, you know. First my sister hop in, then I hop in, and then, you know, <laughs> my mama will hop in the driver's seat or whatever. And, you know, we're going about our business, going about our day. I mean, it was embarrassing in the beginning, but, God damn it, at the same time, I was going to, we're going to fucking walk in. <laughs> But anyways, my mom, in that car, my mom used to keep, like, a thing full of change in her, um, cup holder in her, uh, in her car. So, you know, my, um, so she had two door, she had a two door car, right? So, you know how, like, in vans, like, the back, back window, all the way at the back, they had, the windows don't roll down, but they open it once you, like, push it open a little bit. It, open, it cracks open a little bit. That's how her back windows was. But a van window is way bigger than what I'm talking about. Like, her window was, like, I don't know about... It, it opened about, probably about that wide, or not even wider than that. So, you know what my dumb ass used to do? Of course, my dumb ass always doing something. But, um... <laughs> So, you know, we used to live, okay, in the, of, in the um, apartments, we had a Walmart, like, directly behind our house. Like, it only took us about two minutes to get there. That's how close it was. It was literally in our backyards. So, me and my sister, we wanted to go to the store. We didn't have no money, and my mom was just like, nah, 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 you know, fussing that day or whatever. So, we weren't trying to ask her nothing. She fussing? We ain't trying to ask her nothing. So, you know, I had this bright idea. I was just like, you know, her window was, the back window was open or whatever. And, um, I used to, matter of fact, I'm gonna try to see, when I edit this video, I'm gonna try to see if I can find 
a car similar to the car that I'm talking about so that y'all can actually get the whole visual of me of me in this car okay but anyways you know I had got a bright idea I was just like well let me see if I can fit through this window yes my big ass well I won't be that won't you know be that or whatever but um <laughs> my little big ass would squeeze my ass in this little crack my whole body when I say my whole body, I mean my whole body. I used to get my whole body in there, grab, you know, a handful of change, and then, you know, I would <laughs> go to the front door. I was not about to climb back out the window like that's Now, that's stupid right there, okay? You got to be smart if, you know, you're committing a crime or you're doing something wrong or something like that. You got to be smart about it. You don't want to get caught. So, you know, I always make sure... Well, sometimes I wouldn't even lock the door back so that I wouldn't have to crawl in the window just in case, you know, it was hot outside. And, you know, me and my sister got thirsty and we want to go back to the store and get us something to drink. So, you know, I had to keep the door locked. But, you know, before it was time for us to go in the house, you know, I would lock the door back or whatever like that. So, you know, I mean, that Walmart candy must have been getting to my ass because I must have got bigger or something like over the weeks. I don't know, but I've been climbing, you know, in my mom's window for like a whole month now. So, you know, this one time I cl I tried to climb in, right? And I was just like, dang, this window feel a little tight. So, you know, I'm trying to like, you know, just push it open just a little bit more. Yo, next thing I know, glass shattering everywhere. <laughs> Oh shit, I'm so scared, you know my ass do. I still get in that window because you know the glass is broke now, so my body half most of my body is in the car already. So you know I'm just like hurry up and grab a, <laughs> a handful of change and you know, haul ass. And you know, we had nosy ass fucking neighbors that snitched on us constantly. So when my mom came outside, you know, me and my sister. We, me and my sister, we at the fucking play park or whatever, you know, it's not that far, so, you know, we can see her, you know, going to the car or whatever like that, and, you know, she going on talking about what the fuck happened to my car and all this other shit, and it was just like, I was too fucking scared to tell her that it was me, so my uncle, I guess she was beefing with my uncle or whatever like that, and I guess he used to, he do stupid stuff like that because she accused him of breaking her window and, you know, trying to steal her money or whatever like that. So, you know, I just kept that to myself for a long time. I believe I told my mom this before because, you know, she was consistently saying, I know Dwayne fucking broke my window, da, 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 all this other stuff because <laughs> one time this nigga put gum in our apartment um, lock or whatever, you know how you unlock the door or whatever. He put it in the top lock and the bottom lock so we couldn't use our key to get in the house. You know, that's how, just give you an example of how childish she is. So that's why she thought it was him. So... <laughs> I kept it going and kept it going, but I feel like I told her before. I like I felt like I had to tell her before because, you know, once me and my sister got grown and stuff, you know, I used to tell my mom stuff that I did and stuff like that. I'm like, you can't beat my ass now. I mean, I might as well tell you what I used to do or whatever like that, the things that you didn't catch me doing. Because, you know, my mom, she used to catch us doing almost any and everything. But it was just, you know, these one little here and there that we slipped through the crack, you know, and she don't know about until we tell her. So, I, I think I told her and she did not believe me. She still thought it was my uncle. And I'm just like, no, mom, that was my big ass climbing in your window, stealing your damn chain. I got some memories, y'all. I love you, Ma. <sighs> I miss you. But anyways, rest in peace, Mama. I know you're looking down on me. But anyways, you guys, that is the end of story time. I hope you guys enjoyed my little crazy little story or whatever like that. Don't forget to hit that like button, that subscribe button, that bell button so you get these notifications. Comment down below, let me know how you like my video. If you have any special requests, what you would like for me to do, what you would like for me to talk about, what you would like for me to react to, that's all fine. So I'll take all suggestions, but um, 
Anyways, you guys, stay lit until next time.